105-year-old educator, Dr. Saburo Shochi, set forth on his sixth world lecture tour in November 2011. This landmark tour brought him to Boston, where on November 19th, he attended the 64th annual scientific meeting of the Gerontological Society of America. Dr. Shochi was introduced to the participants by the society president, Donald Ingram, and by a keynote speaker, New York Times best-selling author, Dan Buettner, whose book, The Blue Zones, examines communities around the world with the highest life expectancies. Dr. Craig Wilcox, professor of international health and gerontology at Okinawa International University, told the audience that we have a lot to learn about healthy aging from Dr. Shochi. One of his secrets is, as he likes to tell us, is that he chooses food 30 times every mouthful. So you can imagine if you do that, that's, that's aside from getting pretty strong jaws, uh, y y you also tend to, to eat more slowly and, and take in less <coughs> calories over the, the long term. So. In Boston, Dr. Shochi recounted how his first two children, both born with cerebral palsy, were constantly bullied at school. One child was so mistreated that he was pushed down a school stairwell. Soon after, his children were relegated to staying at home, watching out the window as the other kids went to school each day. As a result, Dr. Shochi took it upon himself to establish a school for developmentally challenged children. In 1954, he sold his family property and opened the Shiinomi School in Fukuoka, Japan. From Boston, Dr. Shochi then made his way to Las Vegas, where on November 21st, he encouraged students at Opportunity Village, an educational and vocational institution for autistic children founded in 1954, the same year Dr. Shochi's Shiinomi School opened. He also paid a visit on November 22nd to Las Vegas Mayor Carolyn Goodman, where the two shared a heartfelt dialogue. Name card. Oh, your name card, my card. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Is that good? Beautiful. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Look at this kitty cat. So we have a kitty cat and a frog. <laughs> thank you, doctor, very much. Very we thank you very much. Are these cute? So all of this made from recyclable <laughs> items. Milk cartons, uh. cake cartons, a little cake carton, which if you look that way, the cake, and you look that way, look there. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah. And all done Next. to help children. And <laughs> beautiful. He then invited Mayor Goodman to join him in a baton exercise, one aspect of his daily regimen of activities for maintaining vitality. Before departing Las Vegas, he spoke to first grade students at the John S. Park Edison Elementary School on November 23rd. Plans are already in place for Dr. Shochi's next global tour, slated for 2012.